Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you and tell you how to connect a Nintendo 64 console just like this one right here to a TV or a television set. This will be a full tutorial, so let's get right into the video. Now essentially, if you want to connect your N64 to a TV, this is the video for you. It's really, really easy to do. I actually don't have a TV here right now. I'm in my basement bathroom. The TV that I was gonna get to bring down here temporarily is in my bedroom right now. And my one of my twin daughters is taking a nap in the bedroom. We have an extra crib in there. They share, anyways, they share a bedroom, but for nap time, one of them sleeps, uh, takes a nap in our bedroom, mine and my wife's bedroom. Uh, so my wife is up there right now with the kids kids to sort of, uh, uh, you know, I was going to say manning the fort, but that's a bad term to use. So she's holding down the fort. So I can't, I'm not ninja enough to sneak in there and get the TV quietly. I'm going to wake her up for sure. So we're doing this without a TV, but really, really easy to explain. So anyways, what you're going to need to do first and foremost is you're going to need to provide power to the Nintendo 64. So you want to get your power brick like this and you want to put it in and obviously it only goes in one orientation because there's a little bit of a of a of a, an out dent here not an indent like an out dent so you want to push it in it's going to click in place and the other end of that is going to have a plug you're going to plug that into your wall outlet and that's going to provide power okay now the second thing that you need to do is you need to get your uh, video cables Here's what the video cables look like. On one end, it's gonna have your uh, red, uh, yellow, and white cables, and I'll explain what those are for in just a moment and what each one means. But on the other end, it's gonna have this connector right here. This, as you can see with the out dent right there as well, this only goes in one orientation. So you're gonna look on the N64 for the other port. You're gonna plug it in, and like I said, it only goes in, like I said, it only goes in one way. So we're gonna plug that in, make sure it plugs in nicely like that. Now I'm gonna place the N64 to the side over here, being careful not to make it drop. Um, I've got a little counter vanity over here. So essentially, you have these three cables right over here. Now, your yellow one, you can think about it as a separate uh, entity because your yellow one is for your video, okay? <clears throat> and your red and your white are for your audio together. So two separate groups. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go to the back of your TV and you're gonna look for an input with these colors on them, an input with these colors on them, okay? You're gonna plug the yellow into the yellow input port, okay? And then on the same line on the back of the TV, because you might have multiple inputs for these, on the same line, so let's say it's gonna be AV1. On AV1, you plug into you, you plug in your yellow, for example, just as an example, it could be AV5, right? But for example, AV1, you plug in your yellow to the yellow port, and on that same line of AV1, the same input, you're going to plug in the white to the white port and the red to the red port. And what that's going to do is that's going to provide you with your video and your audio. And essentially, your Nintendo 64 will be outputting the video and audio to the TV. It's going to go on the TV input, and now the TV has that input to provide video and audio of the Nintendo 64. Make sure you switch to that video mode that you plug this into, and you're good to go. That's how to connect an N64 to a TV, a full tutorial, super easy to do. If you like this video tutorial, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.